We were told by Mr. Morales during our visit that sometimes cameras go into service without the masking software being set up and calibrated because the LCSC is putting new cameras up every day. Well, we tried to follow up on this issue with the LCSC to learn more about how regularly cameras are brought online without the masking feature in place, but our efforts to get more information on this subject have gone unanswered. It seems there is a lot of pressure mounting on the LCSC these days, and rightfully so. And still, they make bad move after bad move in an ongoing attempt to reinvent themselves in the face of continued public criticism. Case in point, when we showed up in late July, we were told that we were not allowed to film at all in the control booth for security reasons. That the LCSC takes very seriously the privacy concerns of those who may be captured on their system, but in yet another sign of a desperate attempt to justify their program, they have allowed a local TV station to film in their control room as well as recently releasing four surveillance videos to their partner Lancaster newspapers for publishing on their website. We have to wonder how the many people captured in this publicly aired footage would feel about the LCSC's flip-flopping on their concerns over the public release of their footage. So, where are you it says there that the black Here's cameras you. have to be in by March 2000. This is where we were on the corner where the four cameras were okay. at the top of the two buildings in the pictures we took of you. 
proliferation of cameras in Lancaster was done in such a stealthy manner that potential harm to the civil liberties of the citizens and the visitors to Lancaster, not to mention many other legitimate concerns, clearly took a back seat to the installation and fundraising for this program. Mayor Richard Gray only recently released a lengthy public letter through a carefully coordinated media campaign outlining his take on the system, his support for it in many respects, and his list of issues that he believes now need to be addressed. A full four years into his term as mayor of this city. One of the recommendations listed in the local Lancaster newspaper recently was, quote, evaluation of the cost and effectiveness of the camera system compared to other forms of crime prevention, end quote. It seems reasonable that this should have been one of the first concerns being brought forth before a single camera was installed in the city, let alone $3 million being raised and spent on what Executive Director Joe Morales calls a, quote, social experiment. Mayor Gray, like so many of his colleagues that fill Lancaster City Council positions, seemed to have remained silent on this issue for years and didn't voice any level of concern or questions until recently pressured to do so. They have, however, in the past, overtly supported this organization through voting to grant large sums of public money, taxpayer funds, to the project. Yet, as the Right to Know requests shows us, Mayor Gray had no trouble using his position as mayor to raise funds for the LCSC. So when Mayor Gray wants you now to believe that he's so concerned about this situation and that he's on the case to protect the public's interest and keep the LCSC on a, quote, short leash, well, we want you to keep in mind that he withheld the recently released recommendations and public address until pressure was put on him to speak up. Unbelievable. The fact that this system has come wow. so far and become so entrenched in the city over a five-year period without any apparent regard for accountability, oversight, and transparency should have raised a red flag to public That's officials. Shit, just walking right underneath it, not even aware of it. Under surveillance. That the people managing and supporting this effort could not be trusted. And that there are indeed other agendas driving this effort that serve private interests and not the public interest. One such example, Bosch International, the company providing the technology to the LCSC, has an employee on the board of the LCSC. For the first time, we're introducing built-in advanced intelligence capabilities exclusive to Bosch including the new and improved AutoTrack 2. The company that introduced its first PTZ dome camera more than a decade ago is transforming CCTV once again. Thank <laughs> you. 